How do you do, pessoal? My name is André, and welcome back to Dave the Diver. So, um, in the last gameplay, I finished the game uh, halfway through a mission. Uh, so there are two activists. As you can see on the top left uh, part of the screen, we actually have uh, two missions. One of them is all done, and it was all done once it started, which is good. Uh, and that's for our uh, VIP. Apparently, we got some VIP people coming to our bar. So uh, we need to. We had to collect a few things that we already had collected, so that Bancho can make a special thing for our guests. And at the same time, uh, what's it called? Peraí, deixa eu ver o nome dele. Duff has lost um, a delivery a package. Uh, and it's in the bottom of the sea, being guarded by a very nasty creature. It's the uh, it's a squid. Uh, and in the morning, we went for the package. We found it, and we now know where it is, kind of. Uh, and now in the afternoon, I'm going to go there, try to retrieve it, and let's see how it goes. Um, so survive for certain. So uh, we got charms now, apparently. Uh, can I? Okay, this the harpoon. So the oh, can I swap? By what? Okay, apparently I can't swap it for anything. Um, so we have an, a harpoon gun that has a damage of seventeen, which is good. Uh, we have plenty of things in storage, which is beautiful. Ooh, I can sell things. By the way, guys, usual message. Uh, if you're here, if you enjoy my channel, don't forget to subscribe to it. Hit that like button. It's very important. Uh, and if you're a subscriber or you become a subscriber, uh, tick the notifications bell so that you know whenever I launch new content. Now, if I go to the shop of this guy, Gun Enhancement Kit. A single-use parts kit used to enhance guns. Okay. Uh, immediately refills the ammo of the gun currently in use. A waterproof cargo box that can be installed underwater. Acquired items can be installed inside and stored items will automatically be retrieved. Can I use it once? This I don't care, nor this. But this could be good. But I'm not sure if it's just... Play. I think this might be worth quite a bit. I should try selling it. Okay. Okay, that's good. So I can sell things. Okay. Giant travel travely fin. Starry puff. Okay. Um. Can I have eye diver? That's twenty four, forty two, two thirty meters. No, I'm gonna save the money because we are hiring people for our um, restaurant, and I need to have money for them. So. Let's head on to uh, find the Liashan uh, do toy doll thing. Clown frogfish. Credo. A clown frogfish. Okay. Okay. Um. There you go. Let's just. We need to have food for our. Ah, carasas. Gotcha. So we need food for our restaurant, so might as well just pick that up and that as well. Now, I uh, the the mechanics of the game say say that uh, every time you go down, the sea is different, but that's not true. At least not for this part. Maybe the items are different, but uh, this area is always the same. And if I go down, I'm, I'm going to find a few more items that are usually there. So, 
Now I need to find oxygen. Ah, wrong thing. Hmm. Okay, I am having a really bad aim. Got a rope. Okay, let's pick it up. Beautiful. Nice. Okay, we're seven and a half kilograms. This is. If this was oxygen, that would be amazing. Oh, better still. Beautiful. Beautiful. And a gun. I want that. Okay. <gasps> okay, so our gun just became better. Now, I am going to find a shark here. Or if not a shark, um, I'm going to find one of those crocodile thingies. Oh yeah. Ah, quas. Okay. Quas. For instance, let's see if I can. Oh yeah. Beautiful. Am I close to where I need to be? Oh, I'm running out of air. Ish. Long distance quest. You know, air is something that I could appreciate very, very much. Okay. I'd like some air. Oh, but see that? Ask and you shall receive. Amazing. <laughs> Currents are going to push me. Okay, I assume that I'm going towards. Yes, this is the place. So. This must be the door. Let's try using the gas cutter from Duff. Sure. Huh? Turn on the cutter and use L to move. Keep your movements inside the circle. Well, that's not good. Okay. This is not gonna be... Opa. Opa. Easy. Oi. Hey, the circle is moving faster. Eh. This is not as easy as it seems. The circle just moves. <gasps> Woo! Nice. Okay. Uh oh. I was in too much of a hurry to properly tell you how to use it, but you figured it out. Going through the open door now. Leah, Leah Shan, your master is coming. <laughs> you sense a dangerous creature's presence. Enter. Once entering, an event will proceed that will end with you returning to the boat. I'm okay with that. Give me that. Huh? <laughs> the space below seems larger than expected. Take a look around, Dave. Oh, that's not good. Okay. Just in case. Level 3. Oh, why do I want a level 3 gun? What's that? <sighs> okay. So we now know that the event will be. Credo. Will be. Okay, the event will be me going to the boat. Is that it? Oh, there's the octopus. Oh, that's not good. 
there it is the pink delivery box with leah shan's inside wait more importantly look at that giant squid so that's your culprit i guess it knows a good thing when it sees it even if it's just a squid it seems to be asleep sneak up and bring it back quietly uh i've got too far to go back empty-handed i guess i'll try approaching it quietly how do you do that you don't Giant squid. Oh, come on. That's not gonna be good. Uh, it's awake. I need to get back. Dave? Don't tell me you're going to chicken out. Yeah, it's of course not just a giant squid. Use the gun I gave you. The harpoon will be of no use. The chance here we come. Okay. Okay, that's not good. Carasas. Oh, that's good. Okay. Okay. Okay, that's not good. Uh, I still have four bullets, so we're good. Okay. Oh, I can still... He's a... Okay. You're gonna... Boomba! Here I go! Easy. Uh, I need a... Okay, I now at least know where he faces. Are we gone? Okay. Opa, that's not good. <laughs> Hola. I'm actually quite surprised that I was able to uh, defeat the thing. Wait, were those sea people just now? Sea people? Sea people? Yeah. Huh? What do you mean? All I can see is the pink delivery box. How the hell can you see? Am I wearing a camera or something? Bring it back quickly. It's waiting its rescue. Telling him won't do any good. I'll have to go up and tell Dr. Bacon. Dr. Bacon. Hmm, the box is pinned under a squid tentacle. I'll have to cut it away. I wonder if it's edible. It should. <laughs> I should try taking it to Poncho. Did I kill the squid? No. Yeah, that's the one. Come back up to the boat. I'm so relieved, Leah Shan. Okay. I am actually quite surprised that I was able to take out the, <laughs> the squid. Yes, Leah Shan, Leah Shan. There's something... 
it's it's cultural, but something interesting about uh, uh, the, uh, fi the 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 girls with the mini skirts and the scholar things. To think she hasn't been damaged. Oh, there's salt water everywhere. I'll clean you up. Here comes Leah's. Whoops, I said Leah Shan's line by accident. Though I'm the master. Ahem. <clears throat> In any case, a promise is a promise. Here you are, the deep sea headlamp. Okay. It's a recent model uh, that turns on automatically as necessary. Beautiful. I must help Leah Shan recover. Goodbye, eternity. <laughs> So 500 gold, yeah, beautiful. So guys, uh, phew, I guess that's over for now. Come to think of it, I did bring this. What will I do with this giant squid tentacle? It smells so awful. I'm not sure it can be used to cook with. I'll have to give it a bunch of a call. Mission updated, giant squid dish. Okay. What's, okay. Where's the giant squid dish thingy? Mm. Mm. Okay, let me call Bancho. Right? Because that's the thing. What is it, Dave? Mm. I I was helping Duff, and I defeated the giant squid. That's incredible. I could bring the whole thing, so I cut off a, a bit of its tentacle. Is it? Is this edible, perhaps? Hmm, of course. The ammonium chloride that helps it float gives it an awful stench. However... And because it's very tough, it's difficult to cook using conventional methods. And I think we'll be we'll be able to offer it to our customers anyway. Why don't you close up close up shop for the day and hold a party with the squid? I've been so busy since we opened that I haven't treated you to any proper food, despite your hard work. Whoa, that sounds fantastic. Let me clean up, clean up a bit. Come to the sushi bar when you're ready. Dr. Bacon will be there as well, so I can tell him about the fish people I saw. I do have the VIP guy. Oh, it just... Okay. <laughs> Eat, drink, and love. Okay. Dave, you're a bit late. Everyone's been waiting for you. Whoa, you finished all the cooking already? When did everyone arrive, though? Uh, talk to Cobra, Bacon, Yoshi, and Banjo. Okay, let's go in order. A party with customers. There's been a lot of progress. Very good. Has there? Restaurants should put their customers first. Food, drinks, service and customers are the basic foundation of a restaurant. In the past, there was only a rigorous chef and his cooking. Hmm. I was also here from the beginning. Yes, but you weren't very noticeable. <laughs> Do you remember what I told you back then about the reviews on Cooksta? You said there wasn't any real mention of me. But now people do mention you. I'll bite, rarely. I'll bite, I'll bite. They say things like, he poured me hot green tea. He was working hard preparing the wasabi. He was friendly. He looked busy. Er, the customers are recognizing your hard work. Well, that makes me feel good. Customers are honest and intuitive. More than you think. More so than you think. They know if you're sincere, kind, diligent or skilled. And they react accordingly. That's why I find this moment hard to believe. <laughs> to think that obstinate Bancho is working with people and holding parties. I think it's thanks to you, Dave. Next ma that makes me wonder what he was like in the past. I can't divulge details about someone else's past. But maybe someday, if the opportunity presents itself, I might be able to tell you. Did she just... Uh, 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 uh. I don't know. Okay. So, Yoshi's done. Okay. Can I... Push the cat away. <laughs> Can I eat? No. Ah, <laughs> Dave, congratulations! Word of Bancho Sushi is now getting around. He looks to be in a very good mood. Look at this squid tentacle. It's the sort of thing you dream of eating as a child. I'll bet more people will flock here if such things are offered on the menu. Aren't we eating this because it's difficult to serve to customers, though? Uh, you're right. What a pity. Everyone will want to try something that looks like this, regardless of the flavor. Regardless of the flavor, you say? There's no way Bancho could stomach that. Let's go with something else. Alright, about the uh, depths. I have a feeling there must be things down there. Things that m that'll make people jump out their seats. If Dr. Bacon research is successful, this place will be famous and filled with people. 
Hmm. All right. When uh, when that happens, we'll make tons of money. So let's keep at it, Dave. Let's get rich together. <laughs> okay, done. Dr. Bacon. Uh, Dr. Bacon. Oh, Dave, what is it? I saw the sea people down below. You what? You really saw sea people and not dung guns? Eh? Dune guns. What the hell is that? What did they look like? Were they dressed? Did they resemble humans? Um, their torsos look like our own, but their sight... But the sight of me scared them off into the depths. I couldn't get a look, a good look. That's too bad. It could have been an amazing find. That means we might encounter them in the depths. That's where the signal is strongest. Perhaps there's an e even a village. A village, yes. They have artifacts, murals, a language. They are beings with a unique civilization. It would not be surprising in the least for them to live together in a village of sorts. That would be quite a find indeed. An ancient civilization under the sea could be revealed to us. Dave, you're my best hope. Keep up the good work. See that? He was barely someone noticeable in the beginning. And now he's just the best. A giant squid tentacle. It really is an ingredient that's difficult to handle. Suppressing the stench should allow me to reach its essence. You're still studying the ingredients. Good work today. Bringing back precious ingredients. This is a difficult sort to prepare, but that's part of the fun of cooking. So, how does it taste? The food has always been great, but today is even more spectacular. <laughs> Since there was a lot of it, I made many different dishes, though we won't be able to offer these to customers. There seems to be no end to the path of the chef. It's a fortunate thing to have a path to pursue. The same can be said of the study of ingredients. Dave, please keep preserving and one day will succeed. I'm not sure what you mean, but uh, sure, I'll be, I'll, uh, I'll be sure to bring back more fish. Pick up beer. Where is beer? And beer. Phew, that's good stuff. Bancho's food is so nice. I can understand the growing popularity of the restaurant. Or maybe it's because I caught the fish. <laughs> In any case, there's been a lot of stuff going on. A giant squid, sea people. There's no end to the mysteries of the ocean, even if it's dangerous. I suppose I'll go even deeper now. Tomorrow. I wonder what I'll find. Eh, whatever. I think I'll think about that tomorrow. Time to toast with everyone and rest. Okay. Nice. So that's a good way to uh, wrap this video. I think. Nice. Oh. Eight all your guys. Oh, that's not good. Yeah. VIP visit D day. Hola, hola, Dr. Bacon. Good morning. I must have drank too much yesterday. I feel sick. You did seem a bit excited. <laughs> you don't get the gatherings like that every day. That sort of occasion calls for jovi jovialty. <laughs> You can't throw up here, Dr. Bacon. Ugh, I'm not the drinker I used to be. In any case, take the deep sea headlamp Dave Duff gave you and try venturing down into the depths. It'll probably turn out on automatically when you reach the night the right depth. Probably. And don't forget, you'll have to enhance your diving suit if you want to venture into the depths. I'll have to enhance my equipment first then. By the way, do you happen to have scuba... Canoage feeding the fish, right? But eight the canoage. Okay, now oh, that's a big part. Okay, Ugh, he's asking me to enter the water after that. Okay, so guys, I'm going to wrap up things here. Uh, some kind of mail is here. Oh, we have mail. Should I check it? No. I'm going to leave things like they are. Open your phone and check your mailbox. Oh, it doesn't allow me to go anywhere. Okay, we need to check the mail. But I... Jellyfish party. Blue Hole Tourism Committee. Hello, residents. We have finally launched a tourism committee to promote the newly discovered mysterious Blue Hole. Our first event, Jellyfish Party, will be held in, th in three days. If you know of any restaurants that can serve jellyfish dishes to match the theme, please spread the word. 
So I take it that's what we need, right? Ah, a party! What a nice looking picture. <laughs> I guess they're trying to open this place for tourism. I just hope it doesn't get too chaotic. Well, it's a party held on a special day. We just need to prepare for more customers. The mail said the party's theme was jellyfish. Jellyfish dishes should be popular. It's October the 15th, so we have three days. Aha, <laughs> make sure to prepare some jellyfish. Whatever kind it may be, let's hit the jackpot. Credo, what's that? Special customers arrive during events. Prepare dishes they like in advance. You might hit jackpot. Okay. Now I'm gonna go away. So, guys, I'm gonna wrap things up here. Uh, we managed to get the doll for Duff. In the meantime, we also fought the squid. I don't think we killed it. I think it might have gotten a bit of a, you know, a sleep and we just chopped one tentacle. So that means that the next time we meet it, it's going to be nastier because it lacks an arm or an tank a, a tentacle. So that's it, guys. Thank you much for watching. I hope that you have enjoyed this little gameplay. And as always, I hope to see you all on my next video. Bye-bye.